I uh, enjoy every aspect of fighting. It allows me to grow as a person and as a fighter. If I can reach a kid that's struggling and like, hey, look, you should pursue your dreams and put all this work into it and follow it, it's gonna work out for you, then it's more rewarding to me than winning a fight. I literally stumbled into fighting. My junior high school, uh, we got a membership at World's Gym to go in and uh, lift weights. And Miguel Torres was renting out a small studio room in the back of the gym. I kind of walked in, looked over in the corner, saw him doing it, and I was like, oh, dude, I want to try that. And then from that moment on, I just, I loved it. My very first time sparring ever was with Miguel Torres, and I can remember this day to this moment because I had the chip tooth to prove it. I walk into the gym, he's standing there, I'm standing there, he's like, hey, you want to spar? And I'm like, uh, yeah, sure. So I just threw him a pair of gloves and stood in front of him, and then he jabbed me right in the mouth and chipped my tooth, and I was like, huh, that kind of sucked, but I want more. I want to learn how to do that. Show me. All three judges scored this fight 20 to 18 for the winner, Neil. I mean, the whole tough experience for me was difficult. I literally tried out for the show four times before I finally made it in. The first time around, it just didn't have enough profile. Second time around, it was just, I didn't make it past the interview part. Third time, it was like, yeah, you just don't have enough experience still. My fourth time, I literally went out and told Dana, like, hey, I came here three times already. I want a chance at the Tough House, and that fourth time worked out perfect for me. I have a degree in criminal justice. I mean, it's one of those things, like, I was very well ready to go ahead and pursue criminal justice and have a career in law enforcement, but I was passionate about MMA. I was, I was like, man, MMA is really what I want to do. It's worked out great for me. I still retired from MMA at my late 30s and transitioned to a career in law enforcement. Postured up. That's it. Hit us all over. Neil Magny with his fifth win in 2014. That ties the modern era record with five. I've been part of MMA for nine years now, and it's, it's finally starting to pay off for me. It is great. It just goes to show everyone else, like, if you have a dream, just go ahead and put your, uh, work towards it. Nothing can hold you back. I mean, it may take a little bit longer than others, but your day in the spotlight will eventually come.